Welcome to a Thanksgiving episode of The Other Side. No, we're not going to Silent Hill. This time, we're reaching out to those of you that are going to have your dinner, but aren't really football fans. You're not going to watch the game, so what are you going to do while well, you're stuffing your face and playing, you know, getting ready to play board games and hanging out with family and annoying that one uncle, because we all got one. I personally am that one. We got some movies that you can watch. Starting off with Poltergeist, available on DVD. Now, as you all know, I'm morally opposed to most remakes and reboots, but this one gets my approval. It stays true to the original, but it also adds up some interesting little twists, some interesting little stuff with shadows that you might want to check out. Definitely worth a look. It's not scary, but neither was the first one in my opinion. If you haven't seen Mad Max yet, Nuclear Wasteland always makes you thankful for what we have today. Check it out. Good action flick. You'll enjoy that. Yes. Another one in the horror because that's my thing. Horror movies. I've got Unfriended over here. Uh, this one, I, it's found footage in a way I hadn't seen before. It really delves on our uh, our obsession with Skype and the, the Snapchat and all the different stuff online and puts a nice little horror twist on it. Also an interesting anti-bullying message in there. Check out Jenna McCarthy and Spy. Really funny. Way funnier than I thought it was going to be. You'll definitely get some chuckles out of that as she saves her boss being a spy. Yes, and you can also, I mean, if you want to, if you want to see Pac-Man, you can check out Pixels and be thankful that Adam Sandler doesn't make more movies. Sorry, Adam, but, you know, go back to writing or something. The scene with the centipede could actually be the future of gaming. That's, it's that worth would be watching cool. that one scene. Also, we have Southpaw. Uh, that one came out a couple of weeks ago. Definitely a boxing movie. Um, it's about getting second chances. Definitely worth checking out. It's a good feel-good movie. And Tomorrowland. Tomorrowland got a lot of negative reviews. I checked it out. I think it's worth checking out. The special effects are really cool. And, hey, it's about a Disney ride. And then, um, it's definitely one you want, might want to avoid this thing right here, Insidious 3. If you haven't seen it yet, don't waste your time. Uh, it's not scary. It doesn't have anything that the other two didn't offer, except for a prequel story that nobody needed. Also, Terminator Genesis, it's worth checking out. Arnold does Arnold's thing, that's on DVD. Streaming on video, um, Ant-Man. Yes, yes, um, Ant-Man from the excellent Marvel Universe. And how could I forget Inside Out for the kids? Yeah, You'll definitely course. enjoy that. Get in touch with your feelings. Yes, um, learn that feelings have feelings. Now, you're saying to yourself, I've already seen all those movies. Give me something I haven't seen. Maybe. Well, here's one you might have not seen, and in celebration of Star Wars coming out, Jesus, just weeks away now, we give you Fanboys, a great movie about a road trip, four friends wanting to go see the Star Wars Episode One before it go gets into theaters. They break into Skywalker Ranch, and they're all doing it because one of their friends is terminally ill. It's a funny movie. Uh, you know, it's just, it's great. It's a, it's a great movie about friendship. I highly recommend it if you haven't seen it. And chances are you haven't. It was a pretty mm -hmm. under-the-radar movie. And it is kind of funny, considering how we feel about Phantom Menace, that they went through all that trouble to go see that movie. So, you're like, well, I've already seen that movie, too. Well, if you're not into movies, then check out the novel Fractured by Marie Lanza. You'll enjoy it. Zombie apocalypse. Make you thankful that all you gotta do is put up with annoying relatives around the table. Exactly. Although those would be handy to have around during a zombie apocalypse, too. Right. So that's our Thanksgiving while you're digesting your food, viewing pleasures of movies to rent, movies to stream. And I just want to shout out to my family on the East Coast and my family here. Very thankful for them. Yes, I'm also thankful for all family and friends. And we're both very thankful for all of you that tune in and watch our show. That's Thank right. you very much. Without you, I'd just be a silly guy running around town in a costume. And I, we'd be filming it, and that would just be weird. So thank you very much for tuning in. Happy Thanksgiving. Happy Thanksgiving. Thanksgiving.